is found murdered in a Charlotte home, and his son is arrested hundreds of miles away. Now, the suspect is calling it an accident, but neighbors are raising some questions tonight. WCNC's Alex Reed took our mobile newsroom to Northwest Charlotte. He's live now with more on exactly what neighbors are telling him. Alex? Well, Sonia, those bullets came through an upstairs bedroom of this house, striking the father asleep in a bed there. Now, neighbors initially heard, as you said, that this was an accidental shooting. So you can imagine their surprise today when they heard that the man's son is now charged with his murder. Neighbors say a lot changed here when Arturo Reyna Jr. moved in a few months ago from Florida. As soon as he got here, the noises got, you know, the music and the... A lot of people start showing up and late nights. And Sunday night, neighbors heard the worst sound yet. I heard two really loud noises, like someone slamming a door. It was the sound of two gunshots hitting a father, apparently asleep in an upstairs bedroom. Everybody's so quiet and that just overnight changed things. Police now believe the man's own son pulled the trigger. I'm still in shock because I couldn't, I just, it's kind of hard to put it in play. The son and the father, I mean, that's kind of hard to swallow. The son had disappeared a day after the shooting. Police in Fort Myers arrested him there today. He's now charged with murder in the shooting death of his own father, who neighbors say was a very different man than his son. Very quiet, very compliant. They followed all the rules. And police in Florida received a tip that Raina would be arriving by bus there today. And since the bus station is literally right next door to the police station there, the police officer simply walked next door to greet the bus and arrested Raina on the spot. Reporting live from our WCNC mobile newsroom in northwest Charlotte, I'm Alex Reed.